Hello friends, it is that time of the week again, believe it or not. Time seems to be going by very quickly. And I wanted to reach out and share an insight on the parasha and a reflection. There's so much action and drama in these parshas over the weeks. Uh, and as always, so much to learn and to take away. So in this week's parsha, Parshas Vayetze, we read how Jacob <coughs> leaves the warm and comfortable confines of beautiful Be'er Sheva and he travels and he leaves and he goes to a place called Haran. Now Haran wasn't exactly a nice neighborhood or have much in the way of Jewish infrastructure. So why would Yaakov leave the warm and comfortable confines of Be'er Sheva, which he called home, and go and leave and travel to a place to the unknown? And I suppose the lesson here being, as the expression goes, no pain, no gain. And we often have to push boundaries and go into uncomfortable places in order to reap benefits and benefits that we would otherwise not be able to take. And hence Yaakov, the leader of the Jewish people, Yaakov's name eventually became Israel. We're called the children of Israel. We too take lesson and inspiration from Yaakov's actions and activities, and that was that he didn't shy away from challenge. In fact, he pursued it. He knew that staying comfortable and staying complacent where he was, he would have been all right. But he wanted better. He wanted bigger. He wanted to be able to set goals and to work towards them and to reach them and to achieve them and to achieve the best for himself and for the people that he led uh, and eventually for all of Israel. So as we read the parish and we take inspiration, whether we've chosen it or not, I think we've all had a bit of a roller coaster of a couple of years, <clears throat> but let that not place us back, let that not weaken us. It will strong, st make, make us stronger, it will strengthen us as a community, as individuals, um, and please God, we'll be able to look back at this time uh, and reflect and see how the difficulties have in fact made us stronger and better. Shabbat Shalom.